draw a horizontal line. Place your compass on the left point. Draw an arc from the second point. Place your point on the right point. Open your lead to the left point of the arc and draw another arc below the line. Place your point on the original point, opening your lead to the right point of the arc and draw another arc up overhead. Continue to switch your compass point between both original points, drawing one half circle and then another. Continue until you're happy with the size of your spiral. You may like to finish it off by drawing a full circle. Here we have our spiral built on two points. Next we will learn how to draw a spiral built on three. Grab your ruler and draw a horizontal line. Make the width of your compass really small. Place your point on the left point of the line and draw two small marks like so. Place your compass point on the right point and draw another mark overhead, crossing with the first. Draw a line through the crossover point and the left point. Repeat on the other side. Place your compass point on the top triangle point. Draw an arc from the left point up to the top line. Place your compass on the right triangle point. Expand your compass until the second arc meets with the first. Repeat from the left point, taking care to expand your compass each time it passes through a new line. Otherwise you'll draw a circle. I cut the side of my video because my hand was in the way. Notice how my triangle point moves clockwise. On every point of the triangle, every time that the lead passes through a new line. You may like to finish your spiral off by drawing a full circle. Next we will draw a spiral built on four points. Start by drawing a mini square. Here's a quick visual recap of how to draw a square. Please follow as best you can. If you find it too tricky to follow these instructions, please click on the cue card up top, which will take you directly to one of my videos, showing step by step how to draw two different types of squares. Then just come back to this video when you're ready. Extend one side of each line like so. If you prefer, you can extend the opposite sides of the lines, if you want your spiral facing the other direction. Here I'm placing my compass point from one point of the square to the next in a clockwise direction, drawing one arc and then the other. Every time I switch points, I open the lid a little wider to meet with the last arc. Next we will learn how to draw a spiral on six points. Start by drawing a mini hexagon. Again, if you're struggling to follow these visual cues, please click on the cue card up top. This will take you to my step-by-step -step how to draw a hexagon class. As you're drawing the lines of the hexagon, please extend one side of each line like so. Tonight, 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 I opened up my eyes. Tonight, 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 I'm wide awake and I, I'm breaking. Place your compass point on the left point of the hexagon and draw a small arc from the top left point of the hexagon. Then place your compass point on the bottom left point of the hexagon and draw another arc, meeting with the first. Extend the arc until you reach the next line. Continue this around the entire hexagon in an anti-clockwise motion.
And there we have it. Next we will draw the golden spiral. Draw a nice generous sized circle. Next draw a square. Here's another visual reminder of how to do so. Again, if you're struggling to follow these instructions, please just click on the cue card up top. It will take you straight to the step-by-step -step class. Extend the right side of the top and bottom lines. Place your compass point on E and extend your lead to D. Draw a mark like so, then place your point on F and draw another mark. Connect these two marks. We now have our golden rectangle. Place your compass point on B, extend to G, and draw a mark like so. Do the same from point G. And again, connect these two intersecting points. Repeat this process from point J and point H. Connect these two lines like so. Continue this until you're able to go no smaller with your compass. Or until you've reached the desired length of your spiral. To draw the spiral, simply place your compass point on D. Open your compass to point C. And then draw a spiral from point C to point B. Place your compass point on I and reduce your compass so that the pen or pencil reaches point B to point J. Continue this as shown. Here we have our golden spiral. If this video was helpful, please consider subscribing. It would mean so much to me. Thanks for watching guys. See you soon.